What's going on YouTube? Geosan right here. So in today's video I'm going to show you how to change the root password for your root user on a rootless jailbreak. So for dopamine jailbreak, for Pelrain jailbreak and stuff like that. The command to do so has changed a little bit. I posted an article a couple of hours ago. You can check it out in the link below with all the instructions. But we're going to get into how we can do it in a second. This video is brought to you by Passive Activation Unlock, a software that allows you to unlock your device if you forgot your password and Apple ID for your device or you accidentally set those or maybe you created an account that is a throwaway for applications, you don't remember the password anymore. If your device is locked in any way or it's unable to activate and it says could not activate or activation error, this could definitely help you fix the device. Definitely check the program out in the link below, it does support Windows as well as Mac OS and a free trial is available. To get the Windows version you press in here and that's about it. We currently have a promotion as well so definitely check it out. You should know that this does support iPhones and iPads as as well. So if you have a tablet, this does support it. So definitely check it out below. All right, so if you have a jailbroken device with a jailbreak that is rootless and not rootful, not a traditional jailbreak, say if you have, for example, Pelerin and stuff like that, here is what you need to do. First, you need to open Cilio and go ahead and search for new term. So go ahead in here, search for new term. And it's going to be this one over here, new term 3 beta. This one supports the rootless jailbreaks and it does work on iOS 15 and iOS 16 and stuff like that. It basically supports iOS 14 and newer and once you have this one installed, you will be able to open it like this. And here you can see that you are the mobile user. So if I write who am I, you can see that it says mobile. Now if you want to change the password, back in the days all you had to do was to basically write password and you would be able to change the password. But now you have to write sudo password and then root. That's the command sudo password and then root. You press return and you're going to be asked for the password for mobile. Now do keep in mind this is not the root password, this is the mobile password, the one that you set in the Pelerin application or the dopamine application once you finished installing Cilio, jailbreaking and stuff like that. You're only asked to set this password once when you finish jailbreaking your device with the Pelerin or dopamine and this is the password you need to type in here, the one that you set. And in my case I left Alpine in here, A-L-P-I-N-E, and then you're being asked for the old root password. I'm going to type Alpine again. In your case it might also be Alpine because that's the default password even on dopamine as far as I know. And then you can set a new password. So for example Alpine1 as an example. Again in here Alpine1. Hopefully you set something better and then press return and that's it. It will show this warning but then that's it. You have indeed changed the password. To test that you can write SU and it will actually require the root password which is going to be alpine one in my case now and as you can see it did log in as root now if i type who am i you can see it says root instead of mobile at the top. So that's it. Now if I type su again and type a different password, you can see that it says something like this, Unix authentication refused. If you get something like this, it means that the password you're using is definitely not the correct one. So you should actually make sure that you know your password for the root user. So that's basically it. It's as simple as that. That's how you change the root password for SSH and stuff like that on rootless jailbreaks. That's basically it. Thank you for watching. I'm Geosnow. Until the next time, peace out.